So there seems to be quite a lot of confusion about weapon zeroing and how it works here in the Hunter Call of the Wild. So I've come to the Hirschfelden shooting range to try to explain it and make sense of how it works. But before we actually fire any shots, there's something I want to show because if you don't know how to get weapon zeroing, first off, it's in your perks and then rifles here at the top. It's this one zeroing level one unlocks short range and level two unlocks long range. As you can see, I have it, but I don't have any zeroing in the bottom right on my HUD. A common mistake is not activating it. All you have to do is click on it, hit activate. It's as simple as that. But now I have it, I can cycle through my zeroing ranges and we'll look at how zeroing works. So to try to explain it, because I think that might actually even be better than showing, basically we are zeroed for 150 meters and I'll even get the range finding binoculars to be sure, but we're looking at targets that are 150 meters away. So zeroed for 150, at a target that is 150 meters away, we should basically be hitting exactly where we're aiming. So I'm a little right there, but that is in the bullseye. Just watch the target on the right, by the way, uh, for the green dot. We'll reset that so nothing's cluttered. So again, 150 meter targets, now we're zeroed for 75. So uh, that basically means we're zero to hit a target that's 75 meters away. The target is 150 meters away. So the bullet is going to drop before it gets there, and therefore we're going to hit a little low. Not too much, because it's not that big of a deal, uh, only 75 meters, but a bit. It'll actually make more sense shooting at 300 meters, because now we're shooting at a target that is 150 meters away, 0 for 300. So, a bullet arcs when it comes out of the gun, and therefore it's going to be way higher than we wanted, because we're only like halfway to where we would be thinking we're going to hit if we're 0 for 300. So you see that hits at the top of the bullseye but the differences are actually a bit more obvious when we are out at 300 meters rather than 150 so we'll do that and once again start at 75 now i believe it's actually just a little bit off uh with it out at 300 meters we should be hitting a little lower even zeroed for 300 but either way if anything i shot at the top of that bullseye and as you can see on the right we are way way low so let's reset that again go for 150 same idea and still way low and it makes sense we're having the bullet drop for 150 full meters before it gets to the target so obviously it's going to hit low now as i said we are actually going to be hitting a little lower here than we should be i think i'm not sure if it's a game issue or whatever but i aimed high and we got right in the center of the bullseye. Did that on purpose so we could actually hit there. As I said, there's a bit of a, a thing when you're shooting at 300, 0 to 4, 300, it hits a little low. So just be aware of that when you're shooting your shots. But that is how zeroing works. I hope that clears it up. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. I'll do my best to clear it up. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you next time.